So does anyone know what that smell is? Okay, early morning. Look at that. Oh, uh, beauty, beauty. Just looking at this sky and just seeing chemtrails right there. It's beautiful, right? No, nah, that's just disgusting. That is what is helping cause mass hysteria in the United States but also the world because there has been a lot of people there has been a lot of documents there has been a lot of people who have come out and said that chemtrails are real all right now I know a lot of people want to see it for themselves and you know they have to have the proof right there smack in their face not all the time I mean if you just look up in the sky look chemtrails chemtrails all right there and you know maybe maybe some of them are chemtrails maybe some of them are just that jet fuel getting released into the air but we don't actually know if it is or not but <laughs> just to have that idea that there's something in the air that has a bunch of things in it that should not be in there and the human body should not be ingesting but are because what is up must come down gravity <coughs> so that's the way they can slowly kill us now think about what it does neurologically psychologically emotionally and stability wise all of that being like that our minds change because if you if you look how the world was 10 years ago eight years ago five years ago before isis even showed around you know yeah there was tension yeah there was distrust there was discordance that's that's always gonna be there but there are things in the world that can make it worse. An example, chemtrails. Crazy or not? I'm just, you know, asking people, you know, honestly, does that sound too crazy? Because if you think about, you know, for chocolate, animals can't eat chocolate, but we can. Why is that? That will kill them. They eat chocolate. We don't really understand why that's that's a thing. So just think about all those chemicals. Think about your family. Whenever you're thinking about chemtrails. Don't just think about yourself. Because maybe you don't care about yourself. Because if you don't care about yourself. Then you're not going to care. You know. If a lot of other people are getting hurt. But... Everyone should care about their family. Everyone should love their family. And if we all have information that we know something, we gotta follow it. So does anyone know what that smell is? That is the smell of victory. And triumph. And acceptance. And that's all I gotta say.